Ohio is a state that has uh, had challenges with algal toxins. I'd have to go back and look at the literature to see what they did to deal with algal toxins there. I'm, I don't recall. So we don't know for sure if this has worked out far. The, there's plenty of research that demonstrates that um, powdered activated carbon and carbon adsorption in general is an effective tool for removing algal toxins from water. So um, there's a lot of confidence in the technology. Uh, again, people, this is an unregulated contaminant. Most people aren't even testing for this. Salem is being very proactive in, in trying to test and, and get uh, trends with algal toxins in the watershed. So um, people aren't required to treat for it. Um, therefore, they're, they're, um, they may have used powdered activated carbon. They may have absorbed algal toxins, but I don't think anything's been done intentionally. Okay, so the literature you're referring to our test is not a large scale. Sort of that's correct.